Living the good life behind bars? Justin Walker is serving a 30-year prison sentence for his involvement in the murder of Pawnee County Sheriff Dwight Woodrell in 2001. Woodrell was shot six times after he interrupted an early morning burglary at a Pawnee oil company. As the Oklahoman's Valerie Brown reports, Walker was able to get a BlackBerry cell phone and drugs into prison and then post images of his exploits to Facebook for the world to see. Brown spoke with Sheriff Woodrell's widow, Karen. Karen Woodwell said, quote, the most disturbing thing is how grotesque they are. You think when they go to prison, their life will be hard, and it's not. See for yourself. These images were captured by Fox23.com and can be viewed on NewsOK.com. Walker started a Facebook page under the name Jess and Walk. It has been posting pictures and comments to the page since early November. Prosecutors filed first-degree murder charges against Walker and co-defendant James Craig Taylor back in 2004 following a nearly three-year-long investigation into Woodrell's murder. Taylor was convicted of second-degree murder and sentenced to life in prison. Walker pleaded no contest and was convicted of second-degree murder by a Tulsa County judge in 2006. What else was found in Walker's cell? Corrections Department spokesman Jerry Massey said guards found a cell phone, marijuana, and a homemade marijuana bong made of paper. As a result, Walker is now in administrative segregation away from other inmates at the maximum security Oklahoma State Penitentiary in McAllister. He will remain there indefinitely. He was moved from his medium security confines at the Oklahoma State Reformatory in Granite after corrections officials were made aware of the Facebook page on Monday evening. The department is investigating how the contraband got into the prison. Walker could face felony charges and more time in prison for the drugs and phone. Stay with News OK in the Oklahoma for updates on this story.